Good morning, guys. Michael, regular guy videos. So, um, not much added. Uh, going to, well, I can't say where I'm going, but I am headed about three hours or so this morning. Pick up some boxes. Tomorrow, I get that big five hour trip to the middle of nowhere. Um, I saw Aladdin last night with my girl. It was actually really good. Um, I guess there's no real spoilers because, well, it's Aladdin. If you haven't seen Aladdin, then there's something wrong. But they added a few things. Uh, they added uh, a new song, for one. Uh, it was pretty good. Um, they also changed a few things from the original. Um, they gave Genie a love interest. And instead of and when he gets becomes free, instead of becoming like a free genie, he's actually just becomes human. So you know that they had that little love interest type type thing, which I liked. I I, I actually liked that. Um, they changed. Oh, they made Jasmine the Sultan instead of the one she married like that was apparently the law they changed instead of allowing her to marry anyone they just allowed her to become the sultan uh, I guess you know Disney is really pushing that whole woman empowerment thing like they did with the all female thing on with the Avengers Endgame but either way I, th I think it works um let's see It had all the original songs, and they did pretty well with them. But the only one I... I mean, the, the Friend Like Me, I wish it hadn't have been as... rappy, I guess. I mean, Will Smith can sing. I mean, he, he, he proves that with the very first song. He can sing. But... He also... With, with some of those songs, instead of just singing them, he rapped them. Uh, or it was kind of, I guess, half singing, half rap. I don't know. Maybe I'm just biased because I like the originals. And Aladdin is one of my all-time favorite Disney movies. But, still. I mean, it wasn't bad. It was just... Uh, it, it downplayed it for me. Maybe because I just don't like rap. But... Um... They did add a few things that, cha that made more sense. Like, apparently, uh, the reason no one uh, recognized Aladdin, given the fact that he actually grew up in the place, was apparently the genie magic made it where people didn't recognize him until his true character started shining through. So, that's why no nobody, like, none of the peasants or shop people, uh, they actually, rec they, none of them actually recognize him, so, that was pretty cool, uh, one thing I didn't like, though, that was changed, was, at the end, it was, you know, Aladdin that came up with the idea to, uh, wish for Jafar to become, or tell, talk Jafar into becoming a genie, and, Genie had no idea in the original, you know, because he was like, I hope you know what you're doing, and it was like purely his idea, but in this one, it was like the Genie caught on like fairly quickly and was like giving him winks and nods and stuff as he was talking about it, and the dude didn't actually wish to become a Genie, he said he wanted to be the most powerful being. So, the genie said, oh, it's a lot of gray area, and boom, kind of like one of those careful what you wish for type things, or D&D, &D, where when you find a genie, you have to be careful about what you wish for with a genie, otherwise you wish for something and they might, you know, screw up your wish and kill you in some way.
I didn't like the change at the very beginning when they, uh, on how he got out of the, tricked him to get out of the cave. Like, in this one, and, like, apparently in this, in this movie, you have to rub the lamp and then say, I wish, blah, blah, blah. Well, apparently it is not a legal wish unless you actually do that. Rub, wish, bam. And the way he tricked him was he slid the lamp over to Abu. And Abu took it behind him. So he didn't rub the lamp. And, and so... I thought it was stupid. I like the original one where he, you know, he thought he was making a wish. And... Uh, maybe that's just me. But... Otherwise, I liked it. I thought it was great. Um, very, very good movie. I did like I did like all the music. Like I said, the rap part tuned it down for me, but I did like it. Uh, I think it definitely sets up a good precedent if they're going to start making all the uh, Disney movies live action. Uh, like I said, Aladdin is one of my favorites. My absolute favorite is Mulan. So I am very interested in seeing how that one goes. Uh, so I can't wait to see for what they do for Mulan. Uh, and Tangled, if they ever actually get that far into making their live actions. I don't think they will get that far. Like they're only doing classics right now. I don't think it'll be a few years before they actually get around to doing the Tangled. Um, videos.